everybody, it's Amelia, obviously. Uh, I'm about to uh, go out. I'm not going out to party. I'm going out to sing in my band. Uh, that's what I do at night during the weekends. So I'm about to go out and do a gig and I figured, you know what? I'm gonna show everybody how I'm gonna do my makeup tonight. So uh, yeah, I'm just gonna show you. It's just gonna be kind of like a, oh, I'm dropping bobby pins. <gasps> Um, I'm gonna just, it's gonna be kind of like a smokier, dirtier kind of a rocker look, so it's not gonna be perfect, which is fine, it's exactly what I want. So, don't judge me, I guess is what I'm saying. So I'm just gonna clip my bangs out of the way. So, first thing I'm gonna do is take a little bit of Urban Decay's Primer Potion in the shade Eden, whoop, and I'm just gonna put that all over my lid. La, 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 la. I need new primer potion. Mine's just about out. So I'm just gonna run it all over. All over my lid. And I already have some makeup on from work, so I'm just gonna leave it. But usually I wear um, tinted moisturizer, but I already have it on. Um, I have a little concealer on left, but I'm gonna add more just because I need to. Okay, so I got my Sleek Makeup Bad Girl palette, and I'm going to be taking this black shade right here. I don't know what it's called, so we're just gonna call it the black shade right there. And I'm just gonna take a flat brush. This is an Urban Decay brush. I got this when I bought the Naked palette. They sent me a brush, so I'm gonna use that and I'm just gonna press it all over my lid. Okay, now that it's up there and it looks like garbage, now we're just gonna blend it out. So I'm gonna find a blending brush in my Bag of Tricks, MAC 217, blending brush. I'm just gonna, using back and forth motions or circular motions, I'm just gonna kind of blend out that line. far in because I just like to be really smoldery and really dark and not all the time my phone's going off probably last minute gig info we're not starting at the time we're starting later that's usually what it is the happy hour band's not done playing yet don't bother coming over yet it's usually what happens so now I'm going to take that same brush in the black and I'm just going to run it underneath my eyes and make it really smudgy and smoky. The lower down you take it, the, most, the more smoky it gets, and I kind of dig that. It's gonna wind up under there anyway, might as well put it there. Every time I play, my makeup just gets really smudgy, uh, you know, even more as the night goes on, and then I just look like a drug addict, which is what every girl wants to look like. Okay, so now that we have that basic effect. Now I'm just going to take a different brush and I'm going to take this um, matte kind of aubergine color and I'm going to blend it on the top. Cyril, I'm just going to put that on my brush, tap off the excess, and just to blend out this line a little more. turns pink really easily. And bruise like a peach as you can imagine. I'm gonna get a little closer so you guys can see it a little more. Okay, now I'm just gonna take a little of that purple and I'm gonna put it in the inner corner right in here, so. Whatever, really just whatever's left on my brush. I'm not gonna add any more. 
Okay, so now that we've got that on, I'm just gonna go ahead quickly and add some liner. I'm going to use my Urban Decay 24-7 Glide-On Pencil in Perversion. I'm really loving this right now, as you can imagine. It's perfect for rock stars like me. Not really a rock star. I'm someone who pretends to be. So, just gonna pull my lid down, add this to my waterline. And I'm gonna tight line with it too. I know it looks really crazy, guys. Because I'm right in the inner corner. And I just love how smoky that makes it look. Now again, guys, I don't want this to be perfect. I want this to be a little haphazard. So that's why I do it really quickly, because I'm just kinda like, well, if I do it really quickly, it'll make it look like I did it really quickly, and then I just like a big bad rock star again. Okay, so now with that same pencil, I'm just going to smudge on my upper lash line. Then I'm going to take my Real Techniques, wherever it is. Now I'm going to take my Real Techniques accent brush, and I'm just going to kind of smudge out that liner that I just did on the top. Okay, now I don't know about any of you, but I have a problem keeping um, eyeliner pencil on my waterline. Always have, always will. I kind of have like weepy eyes. They just drip all the time, so it's really awesome. So I'm going to take that same accent brush and I'm going to take a little of that black powder from my Bad Girl palette and I'm going to tap it on top of the black liner and that'll set it and hopefully it'll stay for a little while at least. And then I'm just going to kind of smudge it along my lash line too. Because I see a little space there and I don't like it. take um, this nude shade from the Bad Girl palette right here and I'm gonna take just a big fluffy brush again I'm just doing this really quickly because I kind of want it to look haphazard and I'm just gonna put it underneath my brow bone so we're gonna blend that color in with the purple that I put on Kind of smudge out that line a little bit. Next, my favorite part, we're gonna put on some mascara and I'm gonna use my Benefit They're Real mascara with my spiky brush. And I don't mind if this looks clumpy. I actually kind of dig that look with something like this. So now I'm just gonna plot in my eyebrows a little more. Um, I'm going to use my Real Techniques brow brush and I got this color at um, Beauty Supply Store and it's by Sorme, I don't know, and it's just a taupe color. And I'm just gonna put my brows on. Exactly what I wanted. And I wanted big, expressive eyebrows so I could please the masses and, and bring joy to everybody with my eyebrows. Yep, that's exactly what I'm gonna do tonight. Okay, so now the most important part. 
Um, I'm going to put concealer on now. This is the Bobbi Brown Creamy Concealer and the shade is Ivory. And I'm actually just gonna use my finger to apply that right now. So I'm just gonna take a little on the end of my finger and I'm just gonna pat it in. Trying not to disturb any of that black or purple that I just put on. the other eye now. And also I'm gonna do right here on my forehead, I'm always really red there. Or on my nose. Picking my nose. Pick me a winner. <laughs> oh, so funny. Anyway. Yeah. And now I'm just going to take the powder underneath the creamy concealer and I'm going to use the Deluxe Crease Brush by Real Techniques. You guys, I'm really liking these brushes, I have to say. So I think they're a really great deal for the money that you spend on them. Oh my God, I almost dropped everything everywhere. And then I'm just going to tap that underneath my eye. Okay, maybe not tap. Maybe I'll blend it. Blending is better. Now I'm just gonna take my Illamasqua blusher in Morale, one of my favorite blushes of all time. I love this color. And I'm going to take my Real Techniques contour brush and I'm just going to apply that on my cheeks. And I don't smile when I do blush. I kinda like to put it where I want to, not where my smile dictates it should be. Rude. I really like this brush for blush, you guys, I have to say. I put product on the very tip of the brush, and then when you swirl it around, the little hairs on the outside blend it out. So, I really like this. I'm going to add a new product that I just bought. It's by Benefit and it's called What's Up and it is a highlighting cream thing. Yeah, I said it. What? And I'm just gonna apply that to my cheekbones and blend it out with my finger. It has a little brush in the end of it. I have no use for that brush. I don't like it. I don't know if you can see, but it just adds kind of like a little bit of a sheen to the tops of my cheekbones, and I'm gonna do that either side. And I like to be shiny. Maybe a little down the side of my nose. Through my brow bone. Ooh, that's pretty, I love that. Love that, gorgeous. Cool, all right. Mm -hmm. And then, and then I'm just gonna add a little chapstick. This is just a general chapstick. I think it's by Avon. It's moisture therapy. I don't usually wear lip colors to gigs only because my mouth is gonna be all over the microphone and it's not gonna, it's not gonna stand. It's gonna be all over the microphone and nobody wants a lipsticky, glossy microphone. So I'm just gonna put this on because I have really dry lips. Because it's super dry here where I live. And that's pretty much it. All right, guys, and that's the finished look. I'm just gonna wear this to my gig. I'm not gonna wear my bangs like this. I'm gonna wear my bangs down. I'm gonna probably gonna tease my hair a little bit. Put some wax in it or something or spray it a whole lot and make it real big because I like to do that. Anyways, I hope you guys like this. Maybe some of you will wear this if you're feeling a little adventurous. I know it's a little out there and it's in your face, but you know, when you're on stage, you kind of have to be in faces. I hope everybody has a spooky day and I hope you're having a great week so far and until next time. I don't know what to say actually. I don't really have like a little tagline that I say right there so I guess I'll just see you in the next video. That's probably good enough. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!